another day, another week, another video. I want to send a special shout out to my dad, DB. <laughs> Stands for dear brother, in case you were wondering. I want to say to my dad, I love you. I'm thankful for you, for all of the things that you've taught me over the years. One of the things especially, and I'm going to do it today, that's keeping a car clean. I remember as a kid, he told me that having a clean car was extremely important. It's more of a... I don't know that I would call it a vain thing, I've been, you know, vanity, but it sure feels good to drive a clean vehicle. So, I'm gonna take today, I'm gonna clean up the truck. It's not terribly dirty, but it is dirty. I'm gonna clean it up, and if I have time, I'm gonna get it waxed and cleaned up and having it look really, really good. So, let's get into this, and let me show you how I clean a car. Time to suds it up. Typically I use Chemical Guys V07. Love that soap, works good on dark vehicles. Normally I do a two bucket method, but this time uh, one of the buckets is missing, so I'm just gonna use one. I wouldn't uh, always do it this way, but sometimes you have to. Time to get the power washer out. It's gonna be hard to uh, pick this up and conversate while my hands are all wet. Let's get this thing foam cannoned up. The foam cannon's great because it helps loosen the dirt and it keeps the finish from getting all scratched up. So let's get it foam cannon, get it washed, and get it ready to move on to the next step. So I gotta do the top of the cab. For that, I have always used a brush. I don't typically use a brush on the rest of the body because as you, if you've ever owned a black car, you know that there is not much that looks better than a good, clean black car. But they also scratch easy. It's a whole nightmare uh, of trying to keep swirls and stuff out of the paint sometimes when you use a brush. So I only use it up on the top of the cab where nobody sees it. It's hard to reach. It's easy enough to just use a good clean brush. So let's finish up with the top of the cab and then we'll be done with the wash. Well, as you can see, the outside is washed and dried. It is time for some wax. It's got to be cleaned up, polished, clay barred, uh, and then eventually a ceramic coating put on it just helps protect it long term. So I'm going to go ahead and drive it around a little bit. I'm going to air dry it, make sure it's good and dry. Yeah. 